Hello everyone, it's Spurs Rail 96 here, and welcome to another Train Symbol 2 roadmap video. Today, Dovetail Games have put out the latest update that concerns the roadmap. So let's take a look at the details. So let's start with the uh, an update that concerns the preservation crew's work or updates and upgrades to routes of the distant past. What Dovetail Games have done is that they have listed all of the preservation updates in the order these projects are most likely to be released to the general public. I have the list here and it reads, in first is Sandpatch Grade, in second is Peninsula Corridor, in third is Great Western Express, and after that it's Northern Trans Pennine, Rosig Nord, Oakville Subdivision, Tees Valley Line, Harpt Strecker Rheinruhr, Rheinruhr Austin, Schnellfahr Strecker Curl to Aachen, East Coastway, the MP36 PH-3C Baby Bullet, the MP15 DC Switcher, Main Spazard Barn, Rapid Transit, Long Island Railroad, and finally the West Somerset Railway. So it's good that we have some sort of clarity in uh, terms of what we can expect from the preservation crews' uh, upgrades and updates to those routes. Um, in terms of, uh, of course, the Spirit of Steam, which was announced fairly recently, that's been added to the roadmap and has been updated accordingly to reflect the announcement that was shared during their Festival of Rail livestream. Uh, in terms of new additions to the roadmap, we have a new route, and that concerns a route from Switzerland. It's called the Swiss Route. Uh, so as development progresses, Dovetail Games will gradually add additional information. They're not prepared to you know, say where the route is in Switzerland, what the time period is, or what the rolling stock we have to play with. But it's pretty cool that we're getting another route in Switzerland. Now, uh, let's take a look at the Horseshoe Curve route, the US heavy freight route. I'm afraid we've got some bad news. It has been delayed intentionally after Dovetail Games discussed with Skyhook Games in terms of the state it is currently in. They were all in agreement that the route requires more time to be worked on, so it can be at a standard that uh, Skyhook and Dovetail Games can say, yep, it's all ready to go, let's release it to the general public. So uh, they've made the decision, both companies have made the decision to give that route more time to be worked on. In terms of the previous roadmap, uh, what happened uh, to the DBBR 232 that was removed uh, from the roadmap, which is of course a locomotive add-on to Ruhr-Signor that's being worked on by Train Sim Germany. This was removed intentionally while TSG focuses on another one of his products that he is producing for the game, the DBBR 420 electric multiple unit. Now once production of the DBBR 420 electric multiple unit is completed, Dovetail and maybe T TSG will have a better understanding of releasing a time frame for the DBBR 232. And finally, to complete the roadmap, they have removed the Taranto ramp and the Amtrak ACS 64 Amtrak 50th anniversary livery from the roadmap, as the work is now completed and is available for everyone to play. But there we are. That concludes this uh, roadmap update. Of course, let me know your thoughts in the comments below. And as always, I will see you next time. Thank you very much. Take care.